Our system and the whole creation is made of sacred geometry. Platon came to humanity and offered that because he could see in his meditation. Nobody really speak of this being in meditation, whether it's Mozart, whether it's Plato and many others. In every civilization, there has been huge knowledge of sacred geometry, geometry that we call sacred. If you look in numbers of mathematics in the Vedas, for instance, we learn about mathematics, it's all sacred. Look at these yantras. All these shape and forms are in our chakras as well as around us and in creation. In the center, you see a point, a dot. You may see this on, on sometime I wear a red dot. What he, on the body, what it does, it activates the pineal gland. Together with this, what we call the bindi, bindi represent the singularity, single, one, oneness. We are now shifting from an old paradigm of separation and we are moving into a transition, not even in the transition, moving towards the transition of a new paradigm of oneness. Mm -hmm. Next. In that oneness, we have... We, we carry within us all the sacred geometry. Well, look, at it, look at a flower, look at a lily, Casablanca lily, any lily. Look at flowers, look at rocks, look at molecules. You see this everywhere. You see the particles, there's these shapes. And when they move, what it does, we have circles into circles. All this in our system, where? And mostly in our heart. Next one, please. And again, we see the bindu, we see the petals of the chakras, we see the, the geometry, the sacred geometry, all the way from Atlantis, Lumeria, Mu, Sumerian. All the structure, architecture, structure, and physical structure I'm speaking of, it, during the, the Sumerian time phase on this planet was made of sacred geometry, a perfection. This flower of life is so ancient and it is within your heart. Within, 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 within. Circle, 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 sphere, 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 within. Mm 